What's up, y'all? It's your boy in a bing. Back here again for another, actually, Chef Bings today, my bad. And today, changing it up a little bit, we're gonna be making some desserts. And what we're making today is creme brulee. So right now we got a quart of half and half, a cup of sugar, six egg yolks, and then we're gonna have a teaspoon of vanilla bean paste, and then later we're gonna need two quarts of water. And let's get right into it, right? So first things first, we're gonna put our half and half, all of it, into a saucepan. Then we're gonna put our teaspoon of vanilla. into the saucepan as well. And then we're gonna put that onto the stove at medium high heat for 15 minutes. I meant two teaspoons about that. <laughs> Yeah, so we just finished boiling the milk, or the half and half, and the vanilla together. Actually, we ended up adding a little more vanilla, just so we thought we needed more. And then once we were done, well, after 15 minutes, we put a lid on and we let it rest for another 15 minutes. And now it's here. So next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put in our six egg yolks. And I know I said one cup of sugar earlier, you could save, take away half of the, one half a cup of it, cause you're gonna use that later. So just take half of it out and then put it in here and then whisk until the color of it starts to lighten. All right, so it should kind of look like this. And then I, I forgot to say earlier, uh, preheat your oven to 325. It'll help, trust. And then so now, once it lightens up in color, you can just add a little bit of your cream at a time and then just stir. Just continue to add little bits at a time and then yeah. Um, so by the time you're done putting in, mixing everything together, it should look like this, very liquidy. And then now all I need to do is just put it into the glasses and then fill up the, uh, the pan with two quarts of hot water, boiling water, same thing. And then you're gonna bake it at 325 for 40 minutes. Covered or not covered? Not covered. Just kidding, covered. Okay, let's be sorry, sorry. Okay, so I filled everything up in the cups, or whatever they're called, and I put it in the pan. So now all you're gonna do is you're gonna put in your water. So you could either put two quarts, or as long as it gets up to halfway, and then fill it up. Oh my God. And then you're gonna put the last one in. And then you're gonna cover this with aluminum foil. And then you're gonna bake it for um, about 40 minutes, 40 to 45 minutes. <laughs> okay, so I filled up all the cups and I put the hot water in. So you can either put two quarts, or just, just as long as it gets like to about halfway. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna put aluminum foil over it. And then you're gonna bake this for 40 to 45 minutes. So we let the creme brulee sit in the fridge for a day. And now the last thing you need to do is just 
put a bunch of sugar on it. And then what we're gonna do is got a lighter. <laughs> you're, not, you're not supposed to use this, but we're testing it out. You can put it back in the oven if you really have to. If you don't have a torch, but yeah, we're just we're just, you just gotta you just gotta the goal of this here is just to melt the sugar. So you get that crispy crust on top. There it is. Creme brulee. <laughs> the boy's out.